we certainly have an opportunity to make significant gains, I think, in the area of safety, the area of green, and the area of, of connectivity. Um, an average car today in, in Europe or the United States has about 50 computers on the car. That's growing. Um, the 50, 50 already. 50. Some have as many as 100 already. So it's, uh, we, we, we're in the automotive world, but we supply more computers than the computer companies do. I mean, it's one way of looking at it. And there's no stopping that trend, right? I mean, you're able to do, you're able to take the mechanical function into an electromechanical or elect electronically controlled. And that opens up a lot of possibilities. So if we do it right, we should be able to have vehicles of the future that have significantly fewer emissions, significantly better fuel economy, incredibly safer, reduce the accident and fatality rate, and allow the consumer to bring that, that digital lifestyle that they have every place else in their life into the car, but do it with less distraction.